in what would be one of the most important fixtures in this year's FIFA World Cup. Poland locked horns with Colombia in a crucial Group H tie which will see two of the biggest teams in the group fight for their survival in the competition. Both of these sides have tasted surprising defeat in the opening fixtures and will be looking to reignite their World Cup hopes with a win at the Kazan Arena on Sunday. Poland, who were initial deemed as one the dark horses going into this tournament suffered a defeat against Senegal, leaving their World Cup hopes hanging in the balance. Chiagu Chonik's own goal and Imbe Niang's second half strike made sure Jegosz Krahowiak's 86th minute goal was only as a consolation for a Polish side who lacked intent and ideas going forward throughout the course of the match. Colombia, on the other hand, were also stuck at the gates during their opener against Japan. Los Cafeteros suffered a shocking 2-1 defeat thanks to goals from Shinji Kagawa and Yuya Osako, both of whom were instrumental as the Blue Samaras outclassed the hapless Colombia. However, Jose Peckerman's side will look to bounce back to form, knowing a defeat could diminish their hopes of doing well in this World Cup. This will be the first competitive meeting between the two sides with the South Americans winning the most recent friendly 2-1 in Chorzo back in 2006. And here, at the hard tackle, we run the rule over these two sides as they look to wrestle each other out of the competition this weekend. Team News and Tactics Poland Adam Nawaka will have a lot of homework to do, as Poland were completely horrendous in their opening fixture versus Senegal. Two wingers failing to provide service to Robert Lewandowski up front and a midfield clearly lacking desire and identity, the Bialo Trevani were outclassed in almost every aspect of the game by their African counterparts and it calls for some heavy measures if they are to keep their World Cup hopes alive this weekend. Experienced winger Jakub Blaszczykowski will be a key outlet for Poland this weekend. Photo by Sean Botterell, Getty Images, Poland are likely to make a few changes to the side that lost to Senegal with Adam Nawaka highly poised to switch to a three-man backline, following the continued absence of Camille Glick. The defensive stalwart of his Monaco has returned to full training but remains a doubt for Sunday's game, meaning we can expect Giago Sionic to partner alongside Michal Pazden and Jan Bednarek in the said three at the back defensive line. Elsewhere, Lukasz Pacek and Masi Edribis will be deployed as wingbacks but are highly expected to drop deep in order to support the central defenders in the defensive phases. In midfield, Nawaka will likely dump Carol Linetti from the starting 11, paving the way for the exciting David Kaunaki, who is expected to play much further forward. Peter Zielinski will be pushed back into the central midfield position and will play alongside Jegosz Krahowiak. Napoli playmaker failed to make a difference against the Senegalese defense but his services will be much more crucial in a deeper position. The role of wider players in Jakub Blaszczykowski and David Kaunaki will also be important as they look to feed off star striker Robert Lewandowski in the final third. Despite all his outstanding scoring record, the Bayern Munich superstar is yet to score in the FIFA World Cup, which might drive him this weekend as he once again carries the hope of nation against Colombia in a highly competitive encounter. Predicted lineups 3-4-3, Szczesny, Pezdan, Bednarek, Sionik, Pacek, Krahowiak, Zielinski, Ribas, Kaunaki, Lewandowski, Blaszczykowski, Colombia Colombian head coach Jose Petrman is also expected to make a few changes into his starting 11. James Rodriguez will likely be fit to be included in the starting lineup, which will be a massive boost for Los Cafeteros. In addition, Juan Quintero, who scored the delightful free kick the other day, is highly expected to be rewarded with an opportunity against Poland, carrying the hopes of the nation. Picture courtesy, AFP, Getty Images, the defensive line, however, will remain the same with Santiago Arias, Davinson Sanchez, Oscar Murillo and Johan Mojica all retaining their place in the starting 11. Meanwhile, David Ospina will start in goal for the South American Giants. Holding midfielder Carlos Sanchez is suspended after his red card against Japan. He is expected to be deputized by Wilmar Barrios, who will start alongside Jefferson Lerma in central midfield. In wider positions, the onus will be Juan Cuadrado and James Rodriguez to provide the attacking width. 
James, in particular, might be forced to play in a wider role due to Quintero's incredible performance in the opening fixture. Colombia's attack will be led by veteran striker Radamel Falcao, who is still looking to find the back of the net in this edition of the FIFA World Cup. Predicted lineups 4 2 3 1 Ospina, Arias, Sanchez, Murillo, Mojica, Barrios, Lerma, Cuadrado, Quintero, James, Falcao. Key stats Poland have lost seven of their past nine World Cup matches, W2, failing to score in six of those losses. They have failed to keep a clean sheet in their past nine World Cup matches, since beating Portugal 1-0 in 1986. Only once before have Colombia lost both of their opening two games in a World Cup tournament, doing so against Romania and the USA back in 1994. None of Colombia's 19 games at the World Cup have ended goalless. Juan Quintero became the first Colombian player to score in two different World Cup tournaments in their opening defeat against Japan, 2014 and 2018. Players to watch James Rodriguez Even though there is still insecurity over James Rodriguez's fitness going into this clash, the 26-year-old will look to wreak havoc in the Poland defense which is already depreciated by the absence of Camille Glick. His ability to carve out a defense could prove to be real problems for Lukasz Pacek and co. While James Rodriguez has been Colombia's golden boy for many years now, Lewandowski has carried his nation throughout the qualifying stage to finally book them a ticket to Russia and is already regarded as one of the best strikers on the planet. Therefore, both of these attackers can prove to be fatal for either of the defenses and it remains to be seen which Bayern attacker prevails as Poland locked horns with Colombia this weekend. Prediction Colombia 2-0 Poland Despite losing their first match against Japan, Colombia looked quite decent throughout the game following an early red card. And if they can further solidify their wobbly defense and let James Rodriguez play to his full potential, Los Cafeteros are huge favorites against Poland, who lack identity and were all over the place in their opening fixture against Senegal.